have here the Triumph Tiger 800. It's quite a machine. It does have a bigger brother, more powerful, more CC, but the 800 version is actually lighter and easier to ride, especially off-road. I've been able to go all over the place, twisties and even off onto the dirt, and it's quite a machine for that. Plenty of luggage at the back. Really, really beautiful riding position. You've got heated hand grips, a nice big screen. It's a great bike for touring as well. ABS, essential for the road and in icy conditions. You've got the ability to take that off so you can ride on the dirt. And uh, the engine has power all the way through. I've been spending a lot of my time at the bottom of the, of the power range, really. There's, um, there's so much power there, lots of torque. So you've got no need to just scream the hell out of it because, you know, there's a lot of engine already. Now there are bigger adventure bikes on the market, but like I said, this is smaller, it's lighter, it's easier to manage, and that's a great thing. My only gripes would be the dated looking cockpit, and really all adventure bikes should come with a removable subframe. Other than that, the Triumph Tiger 800 is a solid adventure tourer that comes as standard with all the creature comforts to make long distance riding as comfortable and safe as possible. So it might be the 2013 Triumph Tiger, but it doesn't matter what motorcycle you have. Two wheels and an engine equals fun, maximum fun. So just grab your helmet, twist the throttle and see for yourself.